Got to feel a vibe. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. I'm doing your weekly reading for the week of the 22nd up to the 28th of July, 2018. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Vibe with me. Spirit of the highest vibration of unconditional love. Can I have two energy readings for the week of the 22nd to the 28th for Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo? One more energy reading for the week of the 22nd to the 28th. Spirit of the highest vibration of unconditional love. Can I have energy readings? For the week of the 22nd to the 28th of July for Capricorn, Taurus, and Virgo. Spirit of the highest vibration of unconditional love. Can I have energy readings for the 22nd to the 28th of July for Capricorn, Taurus, and Virgo? Spirit of the highest vibration of unconditional love. Can I have energy readings for, for the 22nd to the 28th? of July for Capricorn, Taurus, and Virgo. Um, don't mind me. I am very sweaty and can I have to um I can't look into the camera like I used to cuz I am very sweaty right now. Well, wow. Oh my goodness. Give me a second. I got to pause pause the video. <laughs> Sorry about that. Spread of the highest vibration of unconditional love. Can I have energy readings for the 22nd to the 28th of July for Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo? Energy readings for the 22nd to the 28th of July for Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Spread of the highest vibration of unconditional love. Can I have two advice for Capricorn Taurus Virgo for the 22nd of July to the 28th? Bottom of the deck for additional message. Two advice for the 22nd of July to the 28th for Capricorn Taurus Virgo. Bottom of the deck for additional message. Two advice for the 22nd of July to the 28th for Capricorn Taurus Virgo. Bottom of the deck for additional message. So, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, let's do this. So, recently you've had the energy of the lovers to deal with. The four of pentacles, the queen of pentacles. Yeah? So, it's possible that you might have had some form of connection. Or just sharing the love with others more. Yeah? Or have a choice to make between lovers you re realize you have a choice to make recently. Or you're being guided to a particular lover. Yeah? 
So recently, it's possible that you have someone who is possessive over you, not letting go, or someone who is just protective over you, not letting go recently. And um, possibly you are thinking about or have entered a serious relationship recently or a serious phase in your existing relation or a pay raise or increase in your dinero yeah or a permanent position it's possible some a Capricorn Taurus or Virgo by like yourself might have helped you with some thing important to you help you ground your world ground your spiritual and material or just ground your world or help you sort things out figure things out or you might be thinking about some union with someone like that or just someone who is very practical, motherly, you know, um, attentive, you know, someone you can depend on, depend on reliable, reliable, you might be thinking of that connection or have been making move towards that connection recently. So for the week of the 22nd of July to the 28th, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. You might have things balancing out for you this week or starting to balance out or realize that you have need to have patience because the sun is right behind you. Just have patience or balance. Things might be balancing out. You might realize, feel like you're guided. You are being guided. Yeah, but um, you might also be finally having balance and making some fast movements. And um, possibly traveling or getting organized or thinking about making action towards getting pregnant or healing or unconditional love. And why I say that is because you, you are heading towards the Queen of Cups who is a Pis Pisces Cancer or Scorpio who um, could be a Pisces Cancer or Scorpio, just someone who is very loving. He, um sensitive creative affectionate you know um possibly very psychic or you're heading towards quickly towards being psychically heightened or um your intuitions are heightening or um you're heading towards healing yeah you could be having healing this week or you're gonna hear from a organization or someone will be traveling to you or making plans to travel to you or you might be doing that this week movement 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 or getting organized quickly or hearing from an organization or you might be having some heightened psychic abilities healing yeah feeling unconditional love towards someone or they are doing that or both of you are doing that yeah um yeah It's possible that things will balance out from some form of heartache or disappointment that you face or misunderstanding or miscommunication will be balanced out or you need to take time to heal from some form of heartache or disappointment or misunderstanding or miscommunication or someone will be feeling um, disappointed this week because of your actions yeah so um it's possible that you have someone who you deem very valuable to you they possibly do the same or you are having to pause for a minute in some cases some of you and um ha possibly having some distraction towards moving forward or you're gonna quickly move ahead now from being pausing for a while yeah and um, it's possible you might be reflecting on heartache in, of the past or misunderstanding of the past and feeling burdened by that reflection, yeah? Or just burdened overall by some form of connection you have with love or burdened because you need healing, yeah? Or you'll be having some, some changes and fast movements and fast communications and messages coming in, in for some of you after a time of pausing so in the same reading we have the queen and the king of cups showing up yeah so it's possible you have a very strong soulmate connection that you'll be reflecting on this week or attending to or working on or getting increased 
yeah or just taking control of yourself or you might have a Pisces Cancer or Scorpio helping you yeah or any other sign that is very affectionate loving sensitive you know caring possibly intuitive highly intuitive and highly psychic when operating at their highest vibration caring loving yeah possibly working towards some form of connection yeah or yeah or are you just working hard overall to move forward and improve your world and putting in the work and paying attention to details yeah it's possible you or someone might be watching you might be watching someone intensely or they might be watching you intensely yeah to see what you're up to or more than one person might be doing that or you might be working towards making a, 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 a an um communication that's been on the wait yeah or making um some form of yeah truth be told or spoken yeah um or someone might be doing that so we have the judgment here so someone might really be speaking their truth there might be a wake-up call about some form of truth and you might have to be cutting off what's no longer serving you you might also have um just a shake up to get things where it needs to be yeah so yeah capricorn taurus virgo that is your reading for the week of the 22nd to the 28th of july it's very hot <laughs> um i'm now open to doing half hour readings you can contact me through facebook and see if we can work out to do it yeah thank you very much for watching i bid you the highest 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 vibration healing 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 and protection of course i'm not looking into the camera because i'm so hot and sweaty peace